Democracy is not elections, and that is something that we have right. to, yeah. to realize. So in many countries where we assume that there is democracy because there are elections, well, sorry, no, there is no democracy. And it, democracy is about, yes, respect, as we were saying earlier, respect for fundamental rights, respect for human rights, respect for the rule of law, respect, a search for that social justice. And it's something that, it, that uh, number one, it takes time, and it does take all of society, very definitely. But if we look at the year's game, let's say, that, that Nuber put before us, the Club of Madrid was founded in 2001. As a, there was a, as a result of a discussion on transition and consolidation of democracy in Spain, because Spain had had a very successful transition and consolidation of democracy. When the Club of Madrid was founded, and they, originally there were 22 members, as I said, now we have 117, and that could prove to be a, a, you know, a growth of democracy. Well, it's not. Uh, because when it was founded, we were all very optimistic about the future of democracy, and Perhaps now more than ever, we realized that we were wrong. I mean, it wasn't going to be multiplying like the fishes and the loaves. On the contrary, it was going to meet tremendous challenges and all of those challenges that make up life and that because of a number of reasons that come with democracy itself, like freedom of expression, freedom of association, all of those also became, in, ironically, also elements that have in certain spaces weakened democracy. But it is something, that the, the, the basics of, of what one seeks, which I repeat is not the ballot box, remain. And it, those are the challenges. And many of those are very much linked with what uh, we have been talking about in terms of, of humanity, in terms of humanitarian, in terms of uh, social justice but also in terms of the need for dialogue, that the need for people, yes, to speak, to be able to speak, but to listen, because dialogue implies a two-way uh, yep. relationship, let's say, the need to listen, and the need to build those br bridges and to think of society as a whole, as Ricardo was saying. I mean, it, yep. this is not just about political leadership, although we do have to mobilize political will because they will make the decisions. It is about also civil society or citizens' leadership, and civil society, in, in my book at least, also involves the, the, the business sector or the private sector.